Hello and welcome to some more Little Nightmares 2. So if you didn't watch the last couple of videos, well, we just started, but basically we made our way through the forest. We came across a hunter who was trying to hunt us for some reason. We ended up taking him out with his own secret weapon. Well, I guess it wasn't that secret. He's a hunter. He has a gun. Not really a secret. And we ended up on a door, which took us across the water, and we ended up here. So if you've never seen my channel before, please consider subscribing. Also, leave a like, leave a comment, leave whatever you want on the video. Normally, I play Mario Maker, but since it is October, I am playing some spookier-themed games. This is probably going to be the last game we're going to play in October before we get back to Mario Maker in November. So, hopefully you don't mind and appreciate the little detour that I'm taking here. So I gotta say, so far, this game has been really well done. I really love sort of the atmosphere and everything that's been going on so far. Ah, uh, through the window, through the window, to the wall. Every time I hear that song, I think of, oh, what was it? Need for Speed Underground, I think it was from. I heard that all the time. I also think of, there's a video of a guy <clears throat> who was singing that song on like a subway or something like that. And you could tell he was like totally drunk out of his mind or something very entertaining video though can i do anything here with the with the tvs i feel like we need to grab one <clears throat> so that we can boost up through that window over there like can we move this at all No, I'm not trying to climb it. Oh my gosh, I'm not trying to climb it. I'm trying to see if I can move it. Or move anything here. Am I missing something? Hmm. I am le confused. Alright, so we go through here. We can climb up here. How do we get up here? Unless we can get a boost. Oh, we just have to boost ourselves up. Oh, that makes sense. Whoops. <laughs> Did not see the open floor over there. Okay, well, there's a hook or a key or something hanging in the middle. So I think we should... Grab this. Are we supposed to kick this ah okay now that I'm up here what's to the left we do have another TV right here Okay, well, I'm sure that'll be helpful. So, can we meet somewhere in the middle? Are you gonna grab me? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! Oh, we made it.
What are you? What is happening? Oh, we had that happen in the first or second video too. I can't remember which one. But we had it happen in one of them. And it like inhabited my body or something like that. I gotta say, one thing I do appreciate about this game over the first one is that when you walk on like a plank like we just walked across there, it basically it holds you on that plank and even if you move your thumb, it doesn't sort of... It keeps you glued to the plank. In the first one, I found myself just spending a lot of time dying just from like falling over and s stuff like that, falling down things. This isn't creepy at all. Am I supposed to do something with it? Weird. This is some weird, wild stuff. Use L to tune the transmission. Don't know what that means, but I think I'm doing something. Weird. I'm not sure what's happening, but I'm digging the ride that it's taken me on. It's like being in the zero gravity in Fall Guys. Which, by the way, I have been playing way too much Fall Guys. I think last month for the first time ever, Super Mario Maker was not my most played game. It was Fall Guys. Because I played the heck out of it. I feel like... So sometimes I feel like I'm pretty decent at Fall Guys, but I really don't win that often. Even though I feel like I do really well, a lot of times I get in like the top 20% of a level or I even win some of the races and stuff like that, but I can never seem to win the overall game. It's like I always choke in the final round or something like that. Ah, there's a gap behind there. Alright, let's head in. What is this, a playground? Looks like a seesaw there. Is, that a, is this a school? Why is there a bunch of sheets there like they're trying to escape? Are we supposed to climb up the rope? Maybe we are. Maybe that's why it's there. Wait. Come on, get in the net. Oh, I hit the post. There we go. Oh my god, my depth perception. Where is this? How do I... There we go. My god, I had a hard time trying to grab that. Alright, what kind of room is this? A changing room? This looks grabbable. Oh. I wonder if I want that on or off. Okay, let's go down here. Oh, looks like a dormitory.
This ball is moving. I feel like it's telling me to grab it. But what would I do with it? Can you not make so much noise, please? There's probably something in here that's going to kill us. Anything on this side? Doesn't look like it. What am I supposed to do? See, that's... Like, I understand that this is a puzzle game and everything like that, but... A lot of times it's very unclear as to what, what I'm supposed to do. I just took a shot in the dark and apparently it worked. Oh my god, can we get up here now? Can we go through here? Hello, can we not go- ah. I swear to god my depth perception is off today. Nothing like going under the floorboards of the school. Probably lots of rats under here. Maybe a raccoon or a possum. Come on, you can do it. Pull. Pull, little children. Oh, God. Oh, there's someone there. Oh, God. Just kill me now. Put me out of my misery. Yikes. What is this, a home alone trap? Macaulay Culkin, are you here somewhere? How do I get through here? There we go. There's the gap. Mind the gap. Okay, more lockers. This is a giant locker room here. Oh god. What is with the Home Alone traps? Oh god. Who are you? Do we go this way? Did that... that killed me? <laughs> How did a bucket falling down kill me? <laughs> I did not mean to make contact there. Alright, let's wait for them to stop swinging, I suppose. And don't go to the right, because that's going to kill me. So I guess we go down this way? Well, now I'm scared that something's going to swing out at me, or fall down on me, or... God knows what. You see? You see what I mean? All right, let's navigate this one more time. Uh, 
All right, and then we run down here. There's going to be the thing that's going to fall right about here. We avoided that. Is there something here? Okay, I thought that was the doorway, but I wasn't sure. Hello, Mr. Quackers. Eek! Thank God I reacted in time to that one. Why do I feel like this locker is going to do something? <laughs> you could just tell the way it was positioned. No, don't take my friend. My friend. All right, all right, well, time to go looking. Ah. Uh, hey. Is, is it because of my hat? Do you not approve of my hat? I want to come up too. Well, that's not fair. Okay, we can't go back this way. Where do we go? Oh god, this is going to be violent. Oh, jeez. I mean, thank god that kid was made of not human stuff. Sneak up slowly, like a James Bond hit. Oh, never mind. They home alone themselves. Alright, I think it's safe to go. Do I still need the hammer? Can I take it with me? I don't think I can. Which is kind of unfortunate. I kind of wanted to do some damage with that hammer, but... Tis what it is. Can I open these lockers at all? Like, this one is partially open. I can close it. This one looks different than the others. What is... It's one of those things again. I want to know what that is. Dum 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 dum. Oh, I can't even do anything with that locker. All right, let's just keep going. Enough locker shenanigans. Who in the world are you? Can you see me here? Okay, okay. The answer is yes. I assume I just need to go while her back is turned. And if I move when she's looking this way, it's like um, the red light, green light from Squid Games. Ma'am, have you seen Squid Games? Ma'am? What? 
Why was I seen? I thought I was hitting pretty good. Well, here we go again. Just sneaking about. You know, I was sort of thinking the other day, it's really nice to be able to play other games from time to time. Like, I know that I play a lot of Mario Maker on the channel, and like I've said, I play a lot of Fall Guys, but this is a nice sort of break, a nice change of pace from the games that I usually play. And it sucks because, like, I have roughly 100 games on my Switch. I have almost 100 on my wish list too in the eShop. I have a PS4. I have a bunch of old games too. But for whatever reason, I always go back to Mario Maker or Fall Guys, especially lately. So it's nice to be able to basically play something different, especially in October. Like to play some scarier sort of games. Oh, there's a key up there. Can I just climb up here? Oh, nope. <laughs> but then, like, it, it kind of sucks too, because like I said, I do have all these games that I want to play, but I just go back to the same old games. So I don't know if anybody else has that problem at all. Okay, so let me pick up the key. Oh, I was trying to get into that box there. Ew! 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 Do you see me? Do you see me there? You do, don't you? Yeah, you do. Oh, that is disturbing. So pick that up, and then I think I need to hide in this box here. There we go. Ugh. Just like the creaking noises it's making too. It's really weirding and grossing me out. So it looks like I can crawl through here. Can you like just hide in there for now please? Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. I should have just kept going. God, there's there's something about that teacher that is just giving me the heebie-jeebies. And what is the key for? I didn't see any place that would require a key. Run, 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 run. I like to move it, move it. I like to move. Oh, I didn't move fast enough. All right, let's do this again.
Okay, come on, let's go. I can't... I can't move fast enough to avoid her. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, this is okay. This is okay. We can deal with this. We can deal with this. We should be okay. Oh, nobody came after us that time. Thank goodness. Oh, man. Oh god, what is this? All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy? Uh oh. Is this a gnome person or is this uh Not a gnome person. Ooh, hat for me? Am I supposed to do something with you? Oh! Well, I see something on the floor over there by the wall. <laughs> well, that took care of him. I'm guessing I can use it on here, too, to sort of give me a path. <laughs> Through the vents we go. Where we stop, nobody knows. Probably on the other side of the vent. Oh god. Oh, I don't like that shadow. Nope. Definitely did not want to jump there. Ew. Oh god, her stupid head. Alright, so she's definitely coming up here, so we can probably hide in the box. Oops, I fell down the hole again. Here we go, third time's a charm, right? Oh god. It's so disturbing looking at her stupid face and neck. <laughs> Please. 
please don't fall. Jump across? Or do I have to push this down? Okay, we're safe for now. Relatively speaking. Is there anything to the left here? Oh no, it's just a dead end. Oh, why is she in here now? Do I dare climb down? Like, is she down there right now? Ow. <laughs> well, I think with that fall, I'm going to stop the video here. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, leave a comment, consider subscribing as well. We are going to find out the fate of us and the teacher, and we'll see what's going to happen in the next video. But until then, have a good one, and I'll talk to you later. Thank <laughs> you.